Hello and welcome back, and we're still holding off the Italians. As it says, you can see, they occasionally attack us, but I've positioned uh, lots of artillery on our only port, so we should be fine. We just have to keep an eye on that, make sure our defences here are sound, otherwise they will just burst in. But I've uh, deleted all the other ports. Um, our economy is relatively stable, I've also slightly increased taxes, just so I can get enough money to finish these oil wells, which I think will be useful. Then after that we'll probably produce some more agricultural goods. But I think our next logical step, as I want to maintain these guys as um, defensive partners, partners uh, we should invade Montenegro. That's what I'm going to do. I'm going to hope that nobody stops us. Because if, if anybody tries to stop us, especially the Romanians and the Hungarians, even the Croatians could put an end to us. Because all our artillery is here, and some of our other units, so it could be quite useful to have, but we can't utilise it, obviously, against these guys, because we need them to fight the Italians, so it's, it's a difficult situation. But we're pumping out more and more units now. Lots of APCs, which are decent units, and our, luckily now our manpower has increased as we've taken over several nations in the Baltic, so... Or in the Balkans, sorry. Okay, let's declare war on these guys. It shouldn't be too bad, hopefully. We took their capital. And that was actually even easier than I thought it would be. We need reinforcements. They, do, they must have no... Maybe they don't have enough manpower to create garrison units. Yeah, they got like less than a million people. That's cool. We'll just run them down then. Oh, and the Bulgarians are trying to help us. It's interesting. So they may help us against... I could attack these guys, but I think, yeah, we've still got a mutual defence with them. We'll leave them alone. We'll come for them one day, but we'll leave them alone for now. And I also like, uh, like this country because they have no ports. So the, the Italians can't attack us there. They have taken out our our friends in Macedonia, sadly. It might, might, might have been a transport ship, not really sure what that was. So I think, where can we invade next? Where can we get away with? The next logical step would be Croatia, but they have a few ports. How many ports do they have? Yeah. So if I if I rush their capital and then once we conquer them or take one of their ports, I could just delete the port as we go. I'm gonna try that. That might fail hor horribly, but we'll see. I'm also going to get these guys to stop producing infantry for a little bit because we need more artillery if we're going to hold hold some key positions for example the border of Greece because the, the Greeks are very powerful and are quite a key regional player they've got a fair air force I can imagine they've got a few American type aircraft F-16s maybe so yeah, let's get everyone up, apart from our artillery. And that should be producing in no time. And when I try and deal with the Hungarians, I'll probably put artillery here, here, and here. We'll do the same thing we do with Serbia. Attack them and then hope, I hope they run into our artillery. What's supply like in this area? Not particularly good. Not particularly bad. Everyone come up. Actually, now we'll attack from. We'll attack from here. And I'll come back when our forces are fully in position, and maybe, actually, we'll come back when we've produced a few more pieces of artillery. Okay, Germany's just declared war on us. I just waited like a week or two, and Germany has just declared war on us. So that could be pretty terrible actually. Uh, hopefully they don't have any uh, transit treaties with the Austrians and the Italians and things like that. Hungarians, that would be terrible. Uh, we should be fine though. But we definitely can't push too far north. I'm surprised the Germans didn't do that quicker or sooner on. So we may get a few more units attacking us. The Italians and now the Germans. But I think the Germans will probably won't send their battleships or destroyers, I don't think they have that many to be fair and they are just further away in general so we'll keep an eye on that, I don't think it'll be a huge problem but we'll have to keep an eye on it 
but it could be a serious issue. Other than that, we've produced a few pieces of artillery. They're heading, you can see they're heading their way up now. I'll wait a few more days, get a few more pieces of 155mm uh, just to give our uh, tanks and infantry a bit more oomph, a bit more backing. And all the while continuously making sure they can't take this one port, because if they take that we're dead, because they'll take that and they'll flood over as soon as they can. So you guys go up, you guys as well. I'll have a constant flow. Oh, you guys can repair. I wonder how good this is. I think it's like a Serbian. It's a very good unit, actually. Very good aircraft. Repair that. It's a good job, because I think it's our singular. It's our one aircraft we have. So, I'm glad it is good. I wonder what the Italian losses are, then. So, United States have got over 3 million. India... Really two and a half. Russia two million. Let's have a look though. Where's Italy? Italy, they're going up. Twelve thousand. Yeah. And that's all from us as well, that's pretty good. So I imagine we must be really hurting their navy. So who we got here? You guys go up here, you're well experienced, come on. Is there any more artillery being produced? Come on. A couple of things. Anyone at all? Alright. Let's just do it. Put some garrison here first, actually. I'm slightly nervous about this. We're dancing on thin ice. So what you guys get here. I want you to attack from the road, not over the railway bridge. And I'm going to put my units on no initiative. I'm just going to guide them in myself, partly because I don't want the the Italians getting in here and these artillery just wandering off on their own. Okay, you guys just charge. Tell you what, what you got here? Could take casualties. Tell you what. Pull back. And let them come at us. So you ready to play war on us for that? No, everybody's chilled out, it's all good. You guys pull back. And then charge. Not that way, bloody hell. Actually yes, go that way. We can cut their artillery off, that's the main danger there. I am going to put my units on full. So they can withdraw when they need to, because these Croatians are quite strong. Jeez, it's not going well. Gonna have to garrison up the whole area. And there is a way to do that. Uh, battle zone controls. Maximise garrisons in the theatre. So if you press that button, that will put garrisons in every single city. It's going to take a little while, it's going to use up a lot of manpower. Probably all our manpower, but it's going to be necessary. I'll use this artillery and this unit for some reason which is reserved getting this here and it may not be as bad as before I mean they're going to push us back maybe into a heartland but uh, whoa looks like they've got a treaty with the Bosnians so they can push through here. Which makes sense because they can connect their territory in that, but it's incredibly annoying. Dangerous as well. Have we got any garrisons here? Yeah, that's maximum garrisons. The Ukraine has declared war. Okay, we'll keep an eye on that as well. And they're destroying our oil. Tell you what, we're going to have to increase taxes to the maximum. Or tax them, yeah, tax them to the max. Can we save money anywhere else? Healthcare, who needs healthcare? Get rid of that. Uh, everything else is important. Hey, but the Macedonians are helping. That makes everything alright, and I don't think the Bulgarians will be able to help very much. Just 
don't think they were very interested in that. Garrison here. Yeah, you can see our reserve manpower reserve is shot down massively. But it's uh, good to have peace of mind. See, all these villages are now garrisoned or being garrisoned. And we've got to pray that the our allies can do a lot of heavy lifting for us. We carry us all the way to the enemy's capital. But these guys, they have hordes of pretty decent, it looks like, um, artillery. No, it's got a very short range. It's not that good, to be fair. They yeah, do have lots of it, though. Would love to get rid of these guys. Because they have a port there. And if they, for some reason, ally with the Italians, that could be the end. I'm going to stop production of units. Because we don't have the manpower for them. I'd much rather our towns are garrisoned. And our, our economy is stabilizing a little bit. Oh, so sad. The Polish are trying to get in, but the Italians just won't let them. I would love to have peace with you guys. Come on. Be uh, no, they're not interested at all. That's all right. Defending every single town. So if they do try and push in, they will take heavy casualties because our capital is all the way down south. They got to push all the way down. They may take this area, but you know, let them have it. And in fact, since we're not producing any units, I'm going to. Close down our land fabrications as we won't need them anyway. We're not doing for us, and we're not making any units right now, so why not shut them off? So we've, got, we've got these guys here. We can definitely close down the air fabrication as we don't have any air unit designs. That's so kind of pointless. And this one here. No, that's it. How much manpower? That's given us a few. That's given us another 12,000. That's enough to garrison up and just reinforce our units. Yeah, I'm taking the heavy casualties there. So are we there. Try to cut us off here. They're even attacking our trenches. So I'll just... Just disband here. Yeah, we're pushing quite well, we're destroying them. Looks like they might surround these guys, or they might get themselves surrounded more likely. Yeah, we definitely need to... Who have we got here? Do you, you go there. Damn, we need to reconnect this supply. Yeah, we're losing huge amounts of units, but that's fine. We're just going to hope that the Macedonians can help us. And we can wear... these guys are losing units as well, we can wear them down over time. Might as well... yeah. Yeah, they destroyed all our garrisons in these towns, I'll take out this one as well. This is fine. 